Yo, yo, yo! Greetings! This is Scorpion with another song review. One of my songs. But before we get into that, remember to subscribe, like, share, and comment. You know what I'm saying? Subscribe to my YouTube channel because, you know what I'm saying, you're going to get the updates and the, you know, and the dates and the dates. You know what I'm saying? Now, today, the review song today is Hammer and Kongs. This song I did a couple years back. 2013 but I'm just gonna give you a little you know backtrack on how it all started the creative element the idea how it came about now I think it was 2012 my brethren Candyman everybody know Candyman we went to Jarplum Polk City in Richland Park you know and you know you know how the Polk situation is um, you go and you know see what piece of pork you want, yeah, pork, and you know the butcher cut it off for you. So when he was doing that, you know, I always thinking, you know, you know what I'm saying. So you were just chopping the meat, you know what I'm saying. And but before that, I was watching API. Um, I think it's the girl Daniel was doing the the um the program. She went to Union Island. I know Union Island is a Kong's island. You know what I'm saying. But anyway, so the Kongs and the Pongnin, he was not really using a hammer, he was using a butcher knife. But I'm just saying the pounding of it now. And you know, after we after we left there about you know midnight going home, I said, yo, can the boy get an idea, you know? You know, so I went on my phone, record the idea. He was like, hammer, hammer, hammer. I was like, can the man say, yo, that bad, you know what I'm saying? Anyways, you know, make sure I have it on my, on my phone. You don't want to lose these ideas. Then, you know, I went to, you know, I went, I went on vacation for a long time in St. Thomas, you know, Virgin Islands. And there I met um, Bosco, who's a producer, produced some of the big songs over in St. Thomas. And, you know, when I came back to St. Vincent, he sent me a beat. And as I said, you know, just with, with those, you know, experiences, Joplin, and um, you know, watching Miss Daniel's program on API, you know, all this came together. All those thoughts came together, and the song came. So when he sent me the beat, now I started to, you know, vibe the beat, and then I realized the hammer was coming in nice on it now. You know what I'm saying? So I say, hey, you know, let's do this. So I, you know, I, I wrote the song and I sent it for him. I record the song, but then that was in 2012. So when I when he record when, when I recorded the song, I just had to wait for him to give me the you know the final product, but it, it never came. But I remember that same year, Spectrum had Fair the Year, and I performed in Fair the Year, and I gave them a little, you know, a, a little performance of the song before it bust, not knowing that I would not get that song in 2012. You know what I'm saying? Um, so I sang the song, well well received, the reception was amazing. Everybody was already doing the hammer, and I said right away that song is gonna be a big song. But unfortunately, it didn't come out in 2012. So in 2013, now this is where you know the happening is gonna happen. I said, come on, I don't think I'm gonna wait anymore to produce half of that song because you know I find it sticking. Yet. So I went in with a different idea. I said, anyways, this is this is the basis of the song. We're gonna we, we want something to make the song to identify the song from the time it comes on. You must hear it. So I said, let's do something like a boat horn. Right through the song. But you know what I'm saying? So, you know, Kamal put it in. You know what I mean? While, while we were doing that, he came up with a bass pattern. Beautiful bass pattern. You know? And then we rest down the idea and then we leave it for some time. And then we came back. So when we came back to it now, I remember um, Kamal actually saying he don't like the bass. I said, Kamal, you crazy? Doom, 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 doom. I said, you don't like that bass? I said, leave that. And he said, all right, cool. You know what I'm saying? Big up, Kamal. And then, yo, we put the song together. You know, and as soon as he done the mix, I find the hand was a little bit low. I said, Kamal, we need to bring that up. We need to make it, you know what I mean? We need to be elaborate with it. You know what I'm saying? And Bridget, that's it. When the song came out, it took some time, maybe a month. And that song just started this pound on the place. And up to this date, 2018, I could say, it's one of my biggest songs. Anywhere I go, anywhere I perform that song in the world is murder. You know what I'm saying? 
Murder, not killing people. I mean, murder as in vibes, you know what I'm saying? And as I said, you know, sometimes music, as I said in my, in my, in my, in my previous video, music takes time to marinate and you have to load it, love it. Let it grow in juice season and time. You know what I'm saying? And as I said, you know, just keep keep at it. Keep pushing no matter what's going on. Your legacy, the music, will the one that reveal itself to the world. You know what I'm saying? Because you put in so much energy in it. You take time to write your songs. Your songs are not copied. You know what I mean? You're, you're, it's a origin, it comes from an original place. It comes from a good place. So, you know what I mean? How man comes, as I said, is a song. It's, it's very witty, it's, it's comical, you know what I mean? It's, it's creative writing, you know what I mean? Subliminal messages, you know what I mean? You know, people are going to twist and turn. But the point is, when you're writing music, each song takes on its own character. And with that, saying, with that, being, with that said, you have to have a song, which is the lyrics, the melody, the music, the character, the way you articulate, the way you perform the song. In the recording is very important you know what i mean so all these elements come together to create Haman comes and as i said the song did well it went on to you know what i mean to one um well it didn't it didn't win the, the raga soka that year but you know it was one of the it was one of the best performance you could even check that out on youtube i think um it's on on vince powers channel check it out you know Haman comes and you know judge for yourself you know what i mean and as i said that's since 2013 and now it's 2018 so five years song is kicking you know what i mean and i still feel that song that we you know have more to go it's a song that's gonna live on you know what i mean everywhere i perform that song i perform perform two three four five six times you know what i'm saying so that's a little review on Herman kong's remember like share comment subscribe and 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 for my fans out there if you want me to review any any, any of your favorite scorpion song hey just let me know inbox me or just make a comment and i'll do it you know what i'm saying just give you a synopsis of how this song came about you know what i mean so, respect to everybody who've been supporting Scarvin for many years. Remember, keep the music going, keep the love, peace, share, respect, Scarvin, love you. Ah, so me knock it with the hammer, 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 hammer. Ah.